right, we're checking out the only game that would make a person wear a pair of tidy whities made out of poison ivy. It's Brain Game. I played a lot of brain games at this point. This one's starting off with a bang. All the brain games have a definitive lack of brains, but at least in this one, you can select what exactly your brain is supposed to do. My brain is mostly twisted around the fact that Selma Hayek over here is wearing a bra made out of poison sumac. Find the truth. Does the truth involve... Aha! See, I told you. Totally wearing underwear. How about you, Selma? Yep, she's fine too. What is Batman up here in this tree recording all this so we can bring it back to the Batcave? Never mind, it is the most derpy snake the world has ever seen. Why are you afraid of this snake? This snake looks like he needs counseling. Catch the mouse. If I catch the mouse, will his intestines rock it out of his ass? Because that's technically what would happen. What, am I gonna erase this and it's gonna smash the mouse's head in? All right, man, I'm sorry. That's how it goes. Oh, I say, oh, I feel kind of bad because technically like, isn't the tail part of the rat's spine? Help them survive in the co- Holy Jesus. I think the animator may have went a little overboard here. <laughs> oh, I get to draw. A smart man once told me that if you build a man a fire, he'll be warm for a day. But if you set a man on fire, He'll be warm for the rest of his life. There we go. Actually, it just looks like I'm making them go Super Saiyan. Oh, it totally worked! What the hell? And there you go. Basically, if you ever start freezing to death out in the Canadian wilderness, just let your rage take over and it will fuel you. All right, never mind. I just got off the phone with my Canadian friend. He mentioned that they have a distinct lack of rage. Help keep the girl dry in the rain. So what you do, okay, if you don't have a spare umbrella, you use the dead body of your best friend. Now you may be saying to yourself, but Gray, what if my best friend isn't dead? Well, you can fix that. <laughs> this game has a level of flexibility in its drawing that makes me very concerned. Fix his smartphone. What the hell happened here? What, he liked the Instagram girl so much that he bit the top part of his phone off? Now this dude has gorilla glass stuck inside of his gums. He's like, now me and her have something in common. We're both filled with silicon. So real quick, I need to know how, how much leeway does this game give me? Like if I just draw, I don't know, if I just draw like a kitten up here. There, there's a sad little kitten. Does that count? Okay, so you have to be at least somewhat not as dumb as me. So if I draw the cell phone, then I draw his tongue going to the cell phone. He clearly liked nope. the taste of the cell phone. Now the game doesn't like that either. How about if I draw the cell phone, but I also draw the FBI pointing a gun at him because of his creepiness. Nope, can't do that either. All right, I guess I have to just fix the cell phone. She has more than one sword. What sort of ancient ninja outfit is this? I think I may have seen it in like Dead or Alive 2 or something. Uh. <laughs> Okay, where's the other sword at? Oh, I found a, I found a star just chilling out like an earring. Seems like a terrible place to put this. Like turn the wrong way, she slashes her own carotid artery. All right, guess we're going down. That's not really so much of a sword as it is a letter opener. Make her popular. What? <laughs> She's got one like. Wait a minute. I think I know where this is going. Oh, there's actually something you can, what the hell? Oh, of course! Ah, I just, I deleted the whole girl. What the hell happened? I made her popular by making her just a disembodied head. I mean, everyone's talking about it. Seriously, my eraser took a bite out of this girl like Scruff McGruff takes a bite out of crime. Clean the sea sand. Real quick, there's no like violent raccoons or anything down here, is there? Okay. Just checking. Find the truth. What the hell? Is this like a mirror or is he just talking to an identical twin of himself on his iPad? All right, what is the truth? Well, it's definitely not the, the erasure of his clothing. Is he, ah, yes. Again, I deleted half of the person. All of these games require a certain amount of jank in order to work. Now his, uh, his twin brother over here is inside the iPad. He's like, oh my God, I'm an only child. All that's left is my brother's nose and one quarter of his eye. Hold the angry dog. So what you do, okay, is you draw a concerned citizen putting the dog in a chokehold with his gigantic mutant hands. No, not good enough. So how good does the does the chain need to be? Like, can I give the dog a lot of leeway? You know what I mean? Like, here, let's go all around here. The dog could still kill anyone if he wanted to. 
Yeah, see, it totally worked. What is he aiming at? A human head. Got him. The sun is missing. What is this girl at work? If the sun's missing, that means she can go home. I mean, I guess unless she works nights. All right, I'm seeing exactly how much I can get away with. So I'm replacing the sun with a butcher's cleaver. I know it looks like a Swedish fish, but oh, it actually came. What the hell? How hot is the sun? It came out and it just melted her clothing off. What is the dress code here at work? They need help. Oh, it's just a car with no tire. But if you turn the lack of a tire, into another human that they've run over. Totally fine. Make her surprised. Let me guess. Does it involve a distinct lack of clothes? Uh? What the hell? <laughs> what is this? Is it like one of those instances where, you know, a person has like 13 pairs of sunglasses on? <laughs> There's another one. She's like, I moved to Maine and they told me to wear layered clothing. How many layers there? I'm getting the heart faces. I don't think that she's enjoying this. Make the fan working. Make the grammar working. We have to hook it up to a friggin' car battery? <laughs> I mean, sure, this is how everyone uses their fan. Help the prince kill the monster. What sort? of Google acid vomit is this entire scene. This is the prince. Why does the prince have like L cup breasts? Why is the monster the Wicked Witch of the West? You know what? Fine, here we go. You ready? Now you may be wondering what this is. You may be like, great. Is that her tongue unfurling from her mouth and stretching across the entire length of the bow? No. This is a kosher sausage. Totally worked. The prince is over here. They're like, this is what I think you're pork. Bam. Help her get rich. How come being poor just makes you look like you've been scuba diving inside of a washing machine? So there's one of two ways to do this. First way, I think this is the most obvious. Pole dancing. There's one thing I learn in these games. It's the answer is always pole dancing. You gotta have some graphics on the pole. Does that work? No. Oh, hold on. Yeah. Great, we'll give you a million dollars and throw in a free shower. Find the thief hiding in the house. This is a completely accurate representation of what the police looks like. This outfit right here on this girl. Also, why does this house have three washing machines? Three washing machines and terrible cable management. So, I mean, if I plug this one in, oh, I can't even do that. <laughs> You knew it was gonna happen, right? She's like, what's going on? Listen, these washing machines have a mind of their own. I guess in order to find the thief, we'll have to murder him by turning on the washing machine. Oh, maybe not. What the hell? Is it this one? What is happening in here? What is in here? Don't end the board here. Why does this washing machine have eyes? Is there like a child in there? We need to save them too. We can't just catch the bad guy. I love how the scene just ends. It's like, nope, you never get to know. Also, how come this thief looks like he's 12 years old? It looks like a middle school Charlie Brown. She needs more sweeties. What? I don't think you get a figure like this by snorting chocolate cake. All right, where the sweet... <laughs> Really? Why does she have like a Werther's original shoved into her bra? Where the hell's the rest of them? There's supposed to be like two more. Uh, what the hell? This girl's like a reverse diabetic. Instead of using a patch or something like that, like someone that wants to quit smoking, she just duct tapes candies to her. Where's the last one at? I'm running out of- what the hell? Why was it hiding in the cake? Why did her clothes explode off? I love how there's a newspaper like always here. It's like, yeah, breaking news. Chocolate cheesecake suddenly causes people's outer layer of clothing to combust. She needs help. Okay, so. Oh, I was gonna say, why isn't this guy helping her? He's just sitting there waving at her like, yeah, you can do it. <laughs> Keep going. Oh, I think you moved it an inch. Meanwhile, this lady's over here like, I'm blowing out my ACL. Okay, so, I mean, by accident, I think I have figured out the key here. What do you know? Oh, now you want to help, huh? Yeah, now you're going to help. Draw lightning to the golfer. Oh, I'm sorry. My grammar was incorrect. Draw a lightning to the golfer. Is this the police girl? After murdering children inside a washing machine, she goes out to play nine holes, only to have the hand of Thor come down and strike her butter. Make the girl loves the guy. Does it say love hurts? All right, well, I can't erase anyone's clothing. So what does this do? Can I like, imagine Cupid misses the heart and just gets you right in the eye. 
Oh, it totally worked. This girl lost her eye, but she found love, I guess. But they say like love is blind. I can't even move this present. I kind of wanted to see what was in there. What is she hiding? In this game, a pack of hyenas? I don't know. Ah, yes. A staple of any brain game. The patented melon bra. Rescue her. What is she being attacked by? It's like four rolls of fruit by the foot. We don't have to worry about the machine uprising in the Terminator. Instead, fruit by the foot is gonna strangle your ass. Can I erase this stuff though? Nope, it's gotta be the fruit by the foot that gets erased. What is she hiding? Last time it was melons. What? This time it's knowledge. The people in these games never hide knowledge. This is a scam. I've been ripped off. Where's like a where's like a ninja star or something? A cell phone. Come on, there has to be something stupid, like a rubber chicken or something. Come on, where is it? Aha, uh -huh. oh, it's just some glasses. Are you a good window cleaner? I'm not gonna lie, I feel like I've broken more windows than I've cleaned. Wait, hold on, can I, all right, bring this down here. Can I just, holy crap, I didn't clean anything. What the hell happened? I just clicked on the middle of the window. All the grime was like, it's gray, run. What is she writing? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> We've gone into a deep dark land in this game at this point. <laughs> Clearly, uh, this is going to be a hoverboard. It wouldn't be anything long and cylindrical that would get me demonetized by YouTube. Don't make me regret starting to ru- What the hell? What is this? What is she riding a cruise missile? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I, I have so many questions right now. The biggest question is, what is this face? This is not the face of a person who's riding like a tomahawk. Why is he scared? Probably because he's suffocating being wrapped in packing tape. What is this? Do you, do you, <laughs> okay. <laughs> of course, this makes total sense. All right, hold on. What do we, what do we got? Is it another girl in a bikini? Ah, what do you know? Okay, now I, I don't know why he is scared. I didn't know Frankenstein was so afraid of scantily clad women. It's like his kryptonite. He's like, ah, beach girls, no. Don't ever step foot into GTA 5. Help the bees revenge. Why does this have to be revenge? <laughs> this poor lady is like a beekeeper. She's just doing her job, trying to bring honey to the masses. Look, I, I, I appreciate what you're doing for the community, but the game says help the bees revenge in only its best Google Translate, and so, wait, since this isn't a race. You kidding me, you can't race down here? <laughs> Get wrecked. I think my biggest issue here is the prehistoric sized bees. This is what happens when bees start getting tons of hormones. They've been eating McDonald's or something like that. This one bee over here is like the size of a freaking football. Make them scare. What? The further I go into this game, the less I understand what the hell it's trying to tell me. The drawing here is kind of weird too. I didn't know if this was a TV or a microwave. Like if it's a microwave, I get it. They don't want to be cooked alive. If it's a TV, what's gonna happen? Like the ring girl gonna come out? Is it gonna be like a KFC commercial? Oh, it was a, I, it, it could have been either, I don't know. Maybe it is a microwave, maybe it's a TV and it's just showing a picture of a cooked chicken. This chicken is so scared his beak is flying off of his face. Actually, this chicken doesn't look scared. If you notice, see when it goes over to the left, it just looks like it's dabbing. This is exciting because I've never been dabbed on by a chicken. Help the girl from the danger. I hope you got one of them chickens on you because if you don't, your ass is about to get bit. So, Hold on, is it, what the hell? That didn't do anything. Oh, okay, isn't that wholesome? Well, I say it's wholesome. I'm kind of surprised that the grandmother didn't take the mask off and the girl had already had like an aneurysm and died on the ground. <laughs> Help the girl keep her balance. She can't. Because of the way this game endows people, uh, her survival is basically zero. There's nothing I can do. I have to draw something, obviously. What, what the hell do you want me to draw? There, hold on. This is what she thinks of the artist who made the rest of this game. It, was it like a jump rope? Oh, I, I get it. Hold on. I know what it is. She, I can't believe I didn't think of this earlier. There we go. Yeah, right like this. Now I know that you're saying, Gray, that looks inappropriate. But what you don't know is that this is a sledgehammer. See, that was totally the answer. What is she doing? I mean, I don't know. Is she putting something in the trunk? Is this something a body? It's a body, isn't it? Oh, she's washing the car. My expectations of this game are so dark at this point. Ah, yes. Help her warmer. Now, normally you would just draw a sun here and I'm gonna go on a limb here 
But every time it gets warmer in this game, people's clothes get magically blown off their body. But see, instead, I'm gonna draw an entire action sequence. See, this is like Goku over here, right? Giving the world the middle finger, throwing down one of his DBZ balls. BAM! Totally worked! What is the knight waiting for? Poor guy, even 300 isn't safe. It's like an 18 year old Leonidas. He's like, I just killed a dire wolf for you. What more do you want? Okay. Uh, really? Is this what is? Ah! <laughs> Joke's on you, Leonidas. She put all of her points into chastity. <laughs> well, I wanted to test my brain and all I ended up doing was ruining my life. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Brain Game. Till the next time, stay foxy and much love.